In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to add a logo using Elementor. Now, Elementor is a powerful page builder for WordPress that gives you a lot of control over the layout and design of your website. Whether you're setting up a website for the first time or just looking to tweak an existing design, adding your logo is a crucial step in establishing your brand presence and giving your site a professional look. So let's dive right into it. To get started, first, open your WordPress page with Elementor enabled. Ensure you're logged into your WordPress dashboard and navigate to the page where you want to add your logo. Once you've selected the page, you'll want to click on Edit with Elementor. This will take you to the Visual Editor where you can make changes to your page in real time. When you're in Elementor, look over to the left-hand side of your screen. Here, you'll find the Elementor panel with a variety of widgets and tools. Locate the Image widget, which is the key to adding your logo. Simply drag and drop this widget to the specific area on your page where you want your logo to appear. A popular choice is the header section, as this is often the first thing visitors see when they land on your site. With the image widget in place, it's time to adjust its settings. Click on the widget to open its settings panel. Here, you'll see the option to choose image. Go ahead and click this, which will bring up your media library. You can either select an existing image or upload a new one directly from your computer. Make sure you have your logo file ready to go. Once you've chosen your logo, there are a few more settings you can adjust. First, you'll want to set the alt text for your image. This text is important not just for accessibility, allowing screen readers to describe the image to users with visual impairments, but also for search engine optimization. Choose a text that accurately describes your logo or your brand. Next, determine the image size. You can select from options like full size or set a custom size depending on your specific needs. Make sure the size you choose maintains the quality of your logo without unnecessarily slowing down your page's load time. Next, click over to the Style tab. Here, you can adjust the width of your logo to better fit the space you've chosen. You might want to add some spacing around the logo to ensure it sits comfortably within the design of your page. For those of you who want to refine the positioning further, go to the Advanced tab. Here, you have additional controls over margins and padding. Adjusting these can help center your logo or move it slightly to align with other elements on your page. And there you have it. Your logo is now part of your Elementor designed page. Make sure to hit the Update button to save your changes. Adding your logo is a subtle yet significant way to personalize your site, making it uniquely yours. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more tips on making the most of Elementor.